Every human right explained using only means. Right to life. Everyone has the right to exist and be safe from any violence. Even that person who yells howdy everyone at work each morning. Okay maybe not to him, but everyone else definitely have the right to exist. Freedom and equality. All humans are born free. And they all have the right to be treated equal. This includes their race, gender, and whatever makes them horny. On a side note, how should furries be treated? As they don't actually identify as humans. I don't know. Freedom from slavery. Humans should not experience any acts of slavery, nor being objectified and traded, nor be whipped because they can't be farm equipments any longer. Overall, humans should not be treated like objects. And yes, even the women. Freedom from torture. Humans should not be subjected to cruel treatments and degrading acts. Unless they're into it. With consent of course. Do consent guys. Right to equality before the law. Ensuring that everyone is a person under the law, and that individuals are entitled to equal protection, and a fair trial without discrimination. This means even if you sue a rich person, in theory he cannot overpower you with dozens of lawyers, that he each pays seven figures a year, whom will find loopholes around the system, to steal your rights away. Innocent until proven guilty. If a woman accuses you of Bill Cosby and her, you should not go to jail immediately until you get a fair trial, then you will go to jail nonetheless. Bruh. If you're enjoying the video, make sure to spread the alien propaganda by making a successful coup against the current regime in your country, and change its name to Vermicia. So my channel get more famous. Freedom of opinion, thought, and cultural. Everyone is free to express his opinions and thoughts without getting cancelled by the Twitter woke culture, nor get turned into meat steaks, on his own consulate. Humans could also believe in any religion they want, and practice their prayers without anyone stopping them. This also includes participating in cultural life, enjoy whatever art your heart desires, and even scientific developments. And if you create something, like an art or any other whatever, in which you are the owner, it should be protected so no one could steal it from you, or claim it to himself. For example if you develop a game called Tetris, your country shouldn't take it and claim it's theirs now, because you're a comrade. And what belongs to comrades, also belong to the communist party. Wow, two political puns in just one entry, I sure am a smart alien. Actually, not so smart because now I'm on the watchlist by Russia and Saudi Arabia. But I am an alien. They can't do anything to me. Freedom from interference with privacy. All humans are entitled to have privacy which is to not be observed nor disturbed by other people. So when you look for a specific thing on the internet, you should not get an ad about it just 5 minutes later on Facebook. This right also ensures protection from arbitrary interference with family, home, and from attacks on your honor and reputation. Because there is nothing more important than your honor and reputation. Except if you are citizens of any third world countries. Then your honor won't matter as much. Right to free movement and residence. No one should stop you from going and staying in any place you want. Except Area 51. There are no aliens there. Trust me. Maybe you shouldn't go to North Korea either. For your benefit sake I guess. This place that you want to travel to, or stay in, could be inside your own country, or outside. Just don't go to Area 51. Or North Korea. Right to have a family and own kids. Everyone, except minors of course, should be able to get married and create a family without any limitations. So if you want to give up on your dreams and get married, ruining your life in the process, no one is stopping you. Right to own things. You have the right to own whatever you want, and no one should take it from you. From property, to a 12 inch long, 4 inch thick dildo. As long as the thing you own is not illegal, or a person. Right to democracy. Every citizen has the right to take part in the government of his country. Every citizen can be a politician. Lying more than breathing included even become the president. If an old guy with dementia did it, what is stopping you? Right to work. Everyone has the right to work and get an equal payment, women included. The work should be under favorable conditions. So no one should overwork you and make you do double shifts just to get the minimum wage that is barely enough for you and your kids because the father decided to go get some milk and now you are a single mother. But hey, look at the bright side. You can vote. Right to rest. While working, you also have the right to rest. This means you should only work in a reasonably limited working hours, and get periodic holidays with pay, like weekends, to ensure you throw your hard-earned money away, in the club. Right to education. Humans has the right to be educated. Even high education, it's accessible to everyone, and not to those who can pay more. I know you guys hate talking about education, so I will cut it right here. You may find more rights or less, depending on where you look. For example, the Universal Declaration of Human Rights, have 30 rights. But I tried to combine a lot of them under one single entry. So the moral of the story is, if she's unconscious, consent is not necessary. Goodbye.